Corey, those odds. You haven't seen Fnatic play, and complex. Are they? Are they rhyme? I don't know where the doubt is. Like, are they just like well, Afro I, haters or something? Like, uh, he, no, he, the dude can frag. Hopefully, let's see. Let's see, because uh, that smoke's a bit late. Across and oh, Roy, that's ballsy. Disrespect charging through the smoke. Yeah, good one back. Grim down on the back of the site should enable and facilitate a nice clean plant. Four on four in the post. See if they want to fight for this deeper control. Uh, it looks like they are actually lining up to take a bit of an engagement Cheeky towards this side. Well. JT goes looking. Now, there is two. Oh, oh. wow. Two players to find. Oh. Messi lines them up both. JT a contribution. This is a Messi 4K right now. Can he have the ace? That is the question. Crims denies. God damn it, Crims. That's info 2B. Forward positions. Mezzi relaying that information, and there is absolutely no Russian fanatic, as you can see, leaving the bomb towards the Vesper as they start their initial investigations. Boost. I think it was last spotted in AG Black. Let's see what they do with this. Looking to clear out port side. Yeah, Grim looking to flash up for some early banana friction. They didn't pull the trigger on that. Waiting for a sound come, yeah. cue or. I mean, Mezzi's actually probably going to be very quick to anti-flash if it doesn't pop Here perfect. It comes. Yeah, safe. Oh, Mezzi. Okay, two on the swing. Stunning work from the Brit, and he will immediately throw out the smoke. Dexter's behind him with the bomb. They know it's likely at most the one man who threw that flash. Grim, cowering towards the back of the site, just a famas to his name. Summoning Floppy, summoning Halzer. Grim's on the late lurk. Information on that rotation. It has to be a hard clear out of Mezzi, and he does go down to Grim. A big contribution could have been more. He actually hit the headshot.
Afro on that CTAWP. Going to be looking for some impact. He's taking that over towards A. And it's a three-man B lead for our CTs to start off proceedings. This is telling that they want to try and get some banana control here, but they haven't gone all in. Dexus was there early, but backed off. And I think two of your star players, the B defenders, Grim. That was so easy. Just Not like pressured that. at all. No problem. Oh, that's surprising. Mezzi through the smoke, comfortable into Grim to keep things level. And level they are. It's a 2-2 split of their defensive resources. Elise with a silent drop flex. Afro's making his way onto Porchy with the AWP. He doesn't have a smoke to extinguish if necessary. Power position for an AWPer, but look how blind he is. Run down. Crims, he keeps the AWPer alive. Elise goes swinging and Dexter takes down Halzerk. Problematic. It felt like it was all lining up. It was all hunky-dory, but now a two-man advantage for Fnatic to seize the lead and the double digits. Still time for this here. If JT can go in and isolate a fight, I know he has to worry about Dexter towards spawn as well, but they do have a smoke available for that. Is he cautious on his jiggles back new box? Now he's been spotted out. He's calling for help and wow! He gets floppy as well. JT dead too. Clean as you like. That's a great flashbang. Just a white screen for JT. Bro, I like this. This has got some spice to it. Up mid. And that is Dexter's death. Floppy should be a dead man here. Nice to see the AWP in the apartments, Go but he's going to have to get a wiggle on. They're charging long. You're absolutely bang on. He smokes out the bounce. so they'll be assuming pit AWP, Four right? to be. This oh is God. awkward. Oh, my God. Crimson Mezzi. No! No! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Destroyed! <laughs> This one can go the distance. We already had Mongols game versus Mao's go OT. Why not here as well? Oh, he's getting flashed through. He was thinking about it. Oh, oh, Grim is so blind. Spots him out, eliminates the threat. Roy should be dead. JT ensures it. And will treat himself to an AK for his troubles. Well, finally, Roy gets something done with the entry on Banana. Afro's had success with this fight before. Oh, oh. He's going to be mad about that one. Floppy as well, the same character gets revenge. They're pushing top banana again. Or is this just util damage? No, he's going to do a lot. Especially if you follow it up with a push. Mezzi, 28 and counting. Elise going to be dissatisfied with that one. Yeah, 
just looking to evacuate A. He just started to float in towards CT Arch. So with the resmoke top banana, it would make you think, oh, even more damage done. Kind just mad, peppers actually. him on the log. Yeah. So Mezzi shooting him when he can't see him. Dexter rotating over towards A. Crims is now playing for info top mid. I like this. At proactive play. It is proactive, but it's what Floppy's been waiting for. He just... That timing is nuts. Got times to perfection. Dexter can start running any second now. Yeah, he's going... Is he goes speedway, because they'll hear his steps. He goes a long way to avoid Floppy giving again the Floppy again timed. He was holding again. He just <laughs> looked back. The double timing. Here comes the Dexter flash. Oh, yeah. That is cruel. And Mezzi still spotted out the back of the site. 15 seconds. Can Halzok get nothing done? It's all Mezzi. As a dirty 30 delivered in regulation. that they're trying to get Afro picks with. They're not always going to work, but I'm just noting more of this, and they are definitely setting their AWPer up on the CT side to look for fights. Here he is again. It's great to see him not wincing at the occasion, but he has to start hitting some entries. And there's like one. That. Just like that, and taking down Elise as well. A prized scalp. Removed out of the call squad. Five on four. Dexter reinvestigating. Doesn't need to. He knows it was an AWP in play, but the flash at least enables him to do so safely. Three-man CT spread for this defense, and everyone looking a bit Fluff flubby. Today, yeah. That's Roy again. Banana, another death to Grim. He's just having a rough go on this CT side, isn't he? Yeah, it's not been a particularly comfortable shake of the stick. But with the boomstick, Afro, his aggression rewarded. He really is not shying away from an engagement on this AWP, and as you've been pointing fingers at as well, Fnatic setting him up for success. There's a lot of belief in Afro. Could be rewarding Fnatic with their first round here in our overtime. You have to play 2-2. I don't know how you could justify anything else here. He's got a HE as well. Could be well placed. Oh, they're a bit ahead of it. And that's nice from Messi. He might get that 40 after all. Yeah, it's on its way. 35 and 36. He's counting close. Very close to that 40 bomb. Yeah, and then I mean, left it's unwinnable for JC. Yeah, right? left to play whack-a-mole. It's like you have to be really crisp because they're just going to toy with you. It was a four-man B start for Complexity here to try and fortify this banana control. And you can see extra util being left. The goodies for Grim. It means that I guess over towards A, you can burrow down. Elise didn't even hold on to his smoke. But I don't think we'll be seeing him play pit. Well, that's a very announced occupation uh, of apartments. And a late now crawl in towards banana. So the AWP is leading the charge here. And we know about that extra util on the ground towards B. So they've actually gone for the half wall variation. Smoke and Molly combo to either flush them into the fight or back. They can do that again, but it won't buy them enough time. In the meantime, yeah, action in mid. Extinguish herd. Is he ready? Oh, Halzak hits it onto Dexter. Mezzi held at bay by the flame as well. 48 seconds. Rotations are coming through. Complexity looking to send us into a second overtime. Can Fnatic find a way in? Halzuk doesn't think so. Crims down. Mezzi sharp as attack. 
and finding even more damage, damage chipping away at Halzak through the coffins. Trying to send him there. No util for this. Afro's going to need to do a lot here. Yeah, on that AWP. He's primed and ready. Posted for Halzak to disrespect and push any further than the line he's now drawn in the sand. Got to stay tight here, Roy. Value your life. Afro onto a lead. Three on three. Another for Roy. Oh. And it looks good for Fnatic. Floppy late arrival. Advantage gone. And round one. Fnatic take it. And that's the recipe right there that this Fnatic team is going to need. Mezzi at the top of the scoreboard.